head back to Oblivion here. Oh. game don't crash on me now I've played a lot oh what's going on here who's the friend and who's the foe oh wait that's do you Okay. So she's the uh, enemy? Do your best. I give up. Or he is the enemy, Ernest. Well, actually, he wouldn't be the enemy. Where did she go? You're the anvil guard, so you're not the enemy. So, a traveler, why are they fighting her? Alright, let's uh, bring Ernest back to life. So, as you can see with this console command, I can open it up, I can click on a character in the game that has died, and then in the console command I can type in the word resurrection, hit enter, and so then get out about? of the console command and uh I'm Ernest. This is the horse whisperer, Anvil's only stable. Park your nag here or leave him for the wolves, your choice. Alright. Uh what can you tell me about the attack on the chapel? The prophet speaks true. This is the start of something terrible. I can feel it in my bones. All right. Uh, what can you tell me about the prophet? You should listen to him preach. He may sound crazy at first, but the longer you... All right, let me just uh, boost these voices a little bit. Let's try that again. You should listen to him preach. He may sound crazy at first, but the longer you listen, the more sense he makes. All right. Good day. My audio on the voice is still too low. I'll boost it up to 80. Oh, forgot to save. All right, hopefully that'll, uh... I've played a lot of them, really fun, but they do take some learning. They did for me anyway, okay. What do you want? Uh, what can you tell me about the attack on the chapel? It's unbelievable. Right in the center of the city. Nobody saw anything. Makes you wonder about the competence of the guard, if you ask me. All right. Do you know anything about the prophet? Sure. Go down to the chapel and you can't miss him. He'll be the one outside, ranting at passers-by. All right. You too. What do you want? Can you tell me anything about the prophet, miss? He's a blessing on this town. The only one to have made any sense out of the terrible tragedy at the chapel. He preaches every day outside the chapel. Go and listen. You'll see. All right. Well. Goodbye. He's not actually my priority. 
But, uh... Yeah, I need to sell some items anyway. Oh, wait, you know what? Greetings. Hello, guard. He's got his uh, anvil guard attire on. Alright, game, come on. There you go, thank you. Let's go ahead and do another save here. The game kind of acted like it didn't want to, uh... Kind of acted like it didn't want to, uh... Follow through. Greetings to you. New topic, pilgrimage. I think all of the shops are, uh... Timothy LaRouche, late of the Black Dog, able seaman. I'll be staying ashore till my stash runs out, then it's off to sea once more. I think all the shops are on the, uh, out by the harbor, aren't they? Farewell. Hey, okay. Guess who I am? Cane Lawn or Main Lawn? Can learn. Right, the one in blue. You remembered. What do you know about the attack on the chapel? A terrible crime. Everyone in the chapel murdered. Who could have done such a thing, and why? Do you know anything about the prophet? I don't know where he came from. Just appeared outside the chapel a day or so after the attacks. Been there ever since. I see. All right. You too. I'm Arvina Thelus. They call me the Rat Lady on account of all my pet rats. Mm, nice. What can you tell me about Anvil? You can't imagine the fuss some people make. My rats are no problem for anyone. Sure. Whatever you say, lady. Goodbye. All right. So let's see. Oh, you know what? Uh, let's see about getting rid of uh, some armors and weapons. Varel Morvane. Been making weapons and arms here in Anvil for 30 years. People say I do good work, and I don't aim to argue with them. All right, sir, let's see. Uh, oh, you know what? Let's see what we've got here. Well, I certainly need you to fix my boots. Um, Armor, weapons, I have it all. How may I help you? Well, I want to sell... I thought I had three of these daggers. An excellent bargain. Um, all right. Uh, what else? I really can't sell anything else, can I? Okay. I do need uh, some more hammers. Maybe uh, two of them. House with veranda deed. So see, there's all these different items. This, uh... 
House with Veranda Deed. Outdoor Forge Deed. Saw Pit Deed. Spinning Wheel Tanning Rack Deed. Winemaker Deed. Workbench Deed. I'm guessing when you buy these things, you can actually use them to create your own items. You can create your own armors and weapons and things, or at least that's what I'm guessing. Looks rather uh, intriguing. A Dreadnought Half Mask. Interesting. What I need, though, is uh, chainmail uh, gauntlets. Truncheon of Submission. Hmm. Alright, that's about all I can do. A pleasure to serve you. Okay. Good day. And this character? Enelroth, Morvane's apprentice. I see. Can I interest you in some of my wares? Well, let me think here. He doesn't have any armors or anything. You too. All right. Did you ever play Age of Empires Jam Jams? And if so, did you find that which one did you find more enjoyable, Age of Empires or uh, or Civilization? Oh. All right, let's go to the harbor because that's apparently where I'm going to be able to. Anytime now. Where I'll be able to sell all my stuff off, and then we'll go get the uh, Fin Gleam helmet. Go ahead. I'm listening. The flowing bowl. Okay, so that's going to be the inn. Lel's quality merchandise. All right, this is where we want to go. We'll do a save here. You know what, let's, uh... Oh, okay. Let's get some Hi. light. We're all talking about the Emperor's murder. We have no Emperor and no heir. That's never happened before. I suppose we should all be worried. Take care. You too. I'm Norbert Lels. I let my merchandise speak for itself. Look around. If you see something you like, we'll talk about a price. All right. Or uh, Trooper Bra, have you ever uh, have you ever played Age of Empires or any of the Civilization games? And if so, did you uh, enjoy any of them? What can I interest you in? Apron of the Master Artisan, fortify alchemy, armor, and uh, security. All right, let's uh, let's see what I can remove here. I think I'll. Pretty
pretty much Oh, this is what I couldn't sell. This is what I had three of. Alright. Might as well go ahead and get uh, these sold off. Uh, what else? Lesser soul jam. The fang. Actually, let me keep... I think I need to keep the fang. Because I think I need the west wheeled bear fang for a quest. I think I need five of those. Four or five of those to uh, turn in. Alright. A pleasure trading with you. Do you think you could help me with something? Sure. I do need a favor. I brag to my friends about my bravery and about my unique wares and ended up saying I could serve them something very special. An old alien brew rumored to still exist in some of the old ruins. According to the rumors, it's found somewhere to the north. Maybe in Nyerstair or Verando. Will you help me? Yeah, I'll go ahead and help you out. I hope to see you back with it soon. Alright. Well, I don't know if it'll be soon. But we'll see what we can do. Be seeing you. Alright. My name's Quillweave. I've had some success selling stories about the lives of the lower and criminal classes. Good that you want to get better. Well... I'm already an apprentice, so... I'm already doing pretty good, I guess. Bye. Alright, let's go get Finn Gleam. save let's see let's not go the way of the water let's go the way of the path So yeah, so here it is, this little island to the left of the Anvil Coast, which is this structure here, and I don't know if I can remember it, but uh... Basically, there's this rock here at the top of this little, uh, at the top of this island, and you're basically facing out to sea, and, uh, really should do a save here, too. 
Gosh, this is where I'm really gonna need my water breathing, uh... Ninety seconds, sixty nine, sixty seven. Okay. So, yeah, basically from this rock, and you just kind of go straight down into the water, and Fin Gleam should be there. So, you just make your way down. should be here. Um, it should be... Oh yeah, alright, here we go. Here's the skeleton... Fin Gleam. There we go. And this gives you water breathing night eye and detect life. Are you seriously kidding me, game? I have to acquire master level in light armor first before I can wear it? Well, that is a kick in the mouth. Thanks a lot, game, for absolutely nothing. Anyways, that's where you find it. Let's see, there's a large uh, ship here. ship isn't here in the vanilla game, it's part of a mod, but I wouldn't know right offhand. Oh, actually, I do know. This is part of a mod, uh, not Alive Waters, although Alive Waters does add things like these old shipwrecks underwater and all of this, uh, oh, where is it at? The shipwrecks, but then also, well, for heaven's sake, I need to get up before I lose air again. Anyways, Alive Waters adds things like these underwater shipwrecks and seaweed and plant life in the waters of Cyrodiil. But I'm not actually using Alive Waters, I'm using a different mod that does the same thing. You can't really see the seaweed down here. Anyways, I'll put that link in the uh, description as well. For those of you guys that want to check it out. So you can use the live waters for that kind of thing, but I'm using a different mod that does the... that basically does the same thing as... as the live waters. And then I need to reinstall the mod that adds these uh, visual magics, these visual auras to the uh, way shrines. I'm not supposed to look pixelated like that. Way Shrine of Mara. Be humble, live in peace, pray at my chapel altars, and receive my blessings. All right. Thank you, Mara. What did she give me? Uh, probably chameleon? Yeah. Wisdom of Mara. Chainmail 2 set. Um... Why is that only two? It should be three. Chainmail three set. 
Wisdom of Mara. Chainmail three set. Fortify ability. Okay. So just the feather spell gives me is what I get with just uh, two things. Okay. So I am currently with the chameleon spell. Oh, there we go. I guess that didn't last very long, did it? And of course, neither did my game. All right. Let's. Uh... And you know what? I don't think I did a save. Well. It doesn't really matter because I'm not a master of uh, light armor yet. So I can't wear the stupid bloody helmet even if I wanted to. Well, I'm back at the top of the island. You know what, we'll just leave it. I don't need the carry weight if I can't use the stupid bloody helmet, so... We'll just forego the whole goofball thing. Alright. So anyways, yeah, that's where Fin Gleam is lo located. Well, what can I do within the next five minutes or so? Uh, let me just take a look at what I've got here. 274 out of 295. All right. Well, you know what? It doesn't look like my staff is increasing its enchantment. I thought it was. I thought it would be, but I guess not. Actually, you know what I want to do is, uh, found the Anvil Brew House. I want to head back to the arena in the Imperial City. There's actually a modded uh, armor. It's either an armor or a clothing that's in located in one of the, uh, and of course my game crashes. I think I might have to get rid of the uh, brewery mod that I've been using. I had to get rid of the Breville Festival mod I was using because it was causing me uh, it was causing me a number of, it was causing me to crash a little too frequently. So I had to get rid of that because whenever I used it, I couldn't, I could never get into uh, any, I couldn't enter any of the buildings without my game crashing. Alright, so we're back in this area, but I need to get to the arena. and see if I can't locate a uh, armor mod that's supposed to be located on the outskirts of the uh, building here. Another mod for the arena posters. I'll go ahead and uh, put a link for that mod in the description. 
And then, of course, Imperial Waters. That has the uh, waterfalls on the outside of the uh, Imperial structure. Looks really beautiful. And then the Oblivion uh, Celestial Nebula. Absolutely gorgeous at night time. So yeah, I'll put a number of those links to those mods. But for right now, I need to, I want to try and find this other uh, Let me just look at the layout of the uh, map here. I think if I remember right, I think the layout of the map is over here. All right, so we want to go this way. What is it, citizen? Let's see. I th think it's going to be... Well... I wonder if I even got the bloody thing installed. I probably don't even have the thing installed. It should be uh, in one of these areas here. There's evil afoot, citizen, and I've little time for chatter. What is it? Well, if you're going to be that way about it, I'll continue looking. Carry on. I'll continue looking for my uh, location of the armor mod that it I may not have even uh, installed the dadgum thing. Uh, for Pete's sake. Grief. Did I not install it? Yes, I'm the city's arena gatekeeper, but I'm not on duty now. If you want to bet on a fight, see me at the arena between 9 a.m. and 9 p.m. All right. Take care. You have my ear, citizen. Is it up above on the landing, maybe? Oh, crud. Great, now I got a cockroach on my uh, keyboard. How nice. Oh, crud. Well, for goodness sakes, Hail, good How can I, be I probably didn't even install the bloody thing. Alright. Well, I know good and well it's the in the arena area. But, uh, we'll take one last look at this gorgeous... Oblivion Nebula. The beautiful uh, waterfalls of the Imperial City. Gorgeous stuff. Alright guys, that is the stream for tonight. I will uh, try to be back. Saturday morning at 1 a.m. And that is United States Central Time for those of you in Europe or in any of the other uh, nations around the globe. So until then, you guys have a good day or a good night, wherever you may be. And uh, I'll see you all next time. So long, everyone.